my oh, channel, the vlog. So, a long time, let's see. I haven't filmed in two weeks. That is because the first week, it was the week of Thanksgiving, and I wanted to take the time off and spend it with family and just hang out with Eleanor because it's not her first Thanksgiving, it's actually her second, but it's more and more fun this year because she is older, so she's, I don't know, she's just more fun, you know? Um, and then the second week, I wasn't feeling 100%. I had some weird stomach bug going on. I don't know, it's really weird, but I'm feeling much better this week. And I'm actually home the rest of this week. So I thought I would kind of do, instead of a day in the life, do a week in the life. And show you guys like kind of what happens. There's not much going on. I'm, I'm home. I'm being, you know, a stay at home mom this week, but today I actually need to just clean up, do some laundry. I think I may go get a coffee over at Duncan because it is freezing outside. You just saw me take care of the goats. I waited a little longer this morning to take care of them because it was so cold outside and um, got them green. And then as soon as I put my camera down, I had my dog out with me so he could run around, you know, get some exercise, do what dogs do, right? Um, our neighbor's dog likes to just roam freely and he's an older dog. We don't mind that he comes onto our property. He doesn't do any damage. He just, you know, he goes to the bathroom on our property. Not a big deal. Um, but all of a sudden my dog started barking like crazy and I thought, oh gosh, someone is here. So I peeked around the corner of the barn and the dog was there. And Gunner is very, very territorial. And I don't know how he would interact with other dogs. He's interacted really well with other dogs, but other male dogs, because Gunnar is so overprotective of me and our family, if he is in contact with like another dominant dog, there could be issues. So now I'm going to heat up my coffee because mom life, I have to reheat my coffee four times before I finish the full cup, the very first cup, mind you. But Eleanor's asleep right now. I have been catching up on laundry since yesterday. Um, just cleaning here and there. I'm not gonna do a deep cleaning until probably Sunday because Eleanor, every time I clean, you know how it is with a toddler. Do that again. You clean and then as soon as they wake up from their nap or they go into that room, they destroy it. So I'm just not gonna bother doing a deep cleaning just yet. But yeah, I thought I would just take you along, show you what a week looks like for us instead of doing just a day because I am home. There's not a lot to really show. Hi, can I please have a large iced coffee with free whole milk? Okay. And can I please get a medium iced sugar plum macchiato? And then can I get the um, 10 count of munchkins? Can I get five chocolate and five blueberry? I'm gonna be so disappointed if this sugar plum macchiato is disgusting because it's like $4.20. And I haven't been getting Duncan lately because it just hasn't been very good. At least the ones around my area. So I've just been getting Starbucks and Starbucks never disappoints me. But there's no Starbucks near me. Closest one is 30 minutes away. So that sucks. But I need coffee. Josh wants coffee. Okay. This is what it looks like. It's really surprisingly aesthetically aesthetically pleasing purple and the typical brown macchiato color. Alright, let me swirl this. Alright, the coffee doesn't smell burnt. And that's a problem I've been having with Duncan lately is their coffee is burnt. Like, they let it sit on the warmer for too long and then it just tastes like burnt coffee. It tastes gross. Okay. Alright.
to me, it doesn't taste any different than like a caramel macchiato. But I'm gonna go get green for the goats. I'm here now, I need my mask. And I think someone is pulling up right next to me. So I'm gonna go. All right guys, hello, welcome back. It's a long time no see. It's been a few days. I know I said I was gonna vlog this week um, because I was gonna be home. Turns out I had to go to work the very next day after I had filmed the clip of me saying I'm gonna be home all week and I'm gonna do kind of like a week in the life type of thing. It's all good though. It is all good. Um, it was just one day. It's okay. But I went to my parents house today because my brother came back from college for Christmas break and I am so excited. We're all so excited. Especially my sister. So she's my youngest brother. I'm the oldest. My sister is the middle child, if you don't know. I don't really know if you care about that stuff. I like that stuff. I like knowing who is who like in the birth order. I find it very interesting. Anyways, Eleanor just went down for her nap. Um, and I really should be taking a nap myself because I'm pretty tired, but I'm not. There's just some things I need to get done that I want to get done, like making my grocery list for the week. Um, I could go right now after I'm done making my list or I could wait till tomorrow and I'm debating if I want to actually go today and just get it over and done with and not go anywhere tomorrow other than my sister coming by and filling my acrylics um I don't really want to do anything tomorrow so I may do that and I'm debating if like what store I want to go to I know that I'm probably rambling and this really isn't all that interesting to you these are just the thoughts that are running through my head right now and I'm also pretty tired hence But <clears throat> anyways, I need to wake up. So I went through like the pantry and the fridge to kind of get an eyeball of what we have, what I can use for meals so things don't go to waste because we've kind of fallen into that habit again lately of just not using our leftovers. <clears throat> so I want to avoid that and I went through to see what meals were in the fridge for leftovers that I can incorporate into a different meal to kind of like revamp it so it's not the same old boring leftovers. Um, but I'm having a really hard time focusing <laughs> because I'm so tired. But lately, if I've been taking a nap, I wake up really groggy or what happens is I'm so anxious of when Eleanor is gonna wake up from her nap that I don't end up falling asleep and when I do end up falling asleep, it's right when she wakes up. So I just wake up really cranky and just not in a good mood. I'm not in a good mama mood. But I'm going to go ahead and make my grocery list. I don't even know what, what I'm gonna go grocery shopping. We'll figure that out. All right, so I just finished up my list. It took me a little longer because I'm, again, I'm pretty tired. But any, so what I do, I'll kind of show you my thought process on how I make the, um, the menu throughout the week. And then I make my little list. So what I do is I have this old calendar that used to be on our fridge, but the things are no longer sticky. So I just, instead of throwing it out, I use it to kind of guide me through what I want to have for meals throughout the week so I make sure that what I actually buy is what I use that way I don't end up throwing money down the down the uh, trash can so tonight is a Friday we have leftover sloppy joe meat that we need to finish up that was from last night there was quite a bit so we're gonna finish that up um tomorrow we're going to have BLTs and these two things I don't need to get anything for her so they're not on my shopping list because BLTs was part of a meal that I had planned last week um, that we just we never got to because we ended up having leftovers instead 
So BLTs tomorrow, don't need to get anything for these two meals. So what I need to get um, for Sunday is we're going to have some stuffed chicken with Brussels sprouts and salad. Sundays have been the dinner meal that Josh makes for the week <clears throat> and he picked that. Um, Monday night it's going to be frozen pizza because Mondays I kind of eh and I just need something quick and easy. Taco Tuesday. Um, Wednesday is going to be kielbasa with some bell peppers and onions. And then Friday, we're going to have some burgers and fries. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a two pound pack of ground beef and split it up and have one pound for the tacos and one pound for the burgers. And what I do is I will add in a can of corn or black beans to the taco meat so it stretches it even further and you can get more meals out of that taco meat. And then stuffed chicken, we'll probably have leftovers for, so it'll be our meal for our, sun, our Monday lunch. Um, and that's how I kind of guide me personally for the meals throughout the week. And then what I do is I have another whiteboard that I keep on our fridge for anything. Like if we run... Eleanor's smacking her bottle up again, so crib. So I have a, another whiteboard on the fridge and if we run out of something, instead of thinking, oh yeah, I need to get this next week when I go grocery shopping, I automatically put it on that whiteboard. Josh does the same thing. That way we don't have to remember and we don't forget. So I will go through the list that is on the whiteboard and I will put it in my notebook. And what I do is in the corner, I will transfer the meals that I have on the calendar to right here so I can see as I am grocery shopping what I plan for the meals just in case if I by some chance I do forget something on the list I can just double check the meals that we have planned and I can be like oh yeah I forgot to write that down I need to make sure I grab that just how my mind works <clears throat> and then I will write down the ingredients that we need for the meals and then I will write down anything else that we need um snacks food for Eleanor like some mac and cheese yogurt um she really likes the oh I need to write ba get berries she has been loving berries so I need to make sure I get her some of those she likes to have yogurt and berries in the morning for breakfast and if she doesn't eat it here because she does wake up early Monday through Thursday she's not always in the mood to eat breakfast right away so she'll just have her bottle and then I'll pack it for her and she will have it at my parents house for breakfast <clears throat> um, I always have canned corn and canned peas on hand because if Eleanor isn't feeling what we're having for dinner because her little taste palette is going through some changes right now so she is not always wanting what we have I can just give her some canned peas and some canned corn and some like shredded cheese on top and she'll she'll eat it no matter what <clears throat> excuse me but the list this week isn't very long I think it'll be roughly around 150. It's got to be less than 150 because I definitely got more last week and it was 137. I try to cap our grocery budget every week at 150 and that is including toiletries and dog food, cat food, and miscellaneous items like that. But I normally get cat food and dog food and kitty litter at uh, BJ's. So I think this will definitely stay under 150. I want to say it's got to be less than that. I'm thinking maybe 120, 130. We will see. All right, you guys. So I am going to close out this vlog. I know that this video is probably <laughs> boring, um, sporadic, a little odd, but I apologize if it's not exactly exciting and not what you were hoping to see but i mean it was like a week in the life and what i thought was going to be a week in the life video ended up being not so much a week because i got called back into work so i had to work around my work schedule and eleanor's schedule um but yes i just filmed two videos which you guys will be seeing later on um i'm trying to think there's not much else going on here. <sighs> yeah, 
there's nothing going on. I just wanted to close out this video and I will be pushing a lot more contact content out later on. You guys will see a whole bunch of videos. Um, I'm super excited about that. Um, a lot of new exciting video ideas are swirling around in my head and I need to just put them on paper. But yes, I need to edit this video. I need to upload it tonight. So it's um, live tomorrow morning. I know I'm really late on uploading. I was supposed to upload yesterday. Um, it just didn't happen. It didn't. I got so busy with um, watching Eleanor and just playing with her that time escaped me. But yeah, I will see you guys later. And thank you so much. Bye.